That was 10 things. What's up? I'm Lil Baby, and these are my essentials. My main and first essential will be God or the Most High. And I say that because I wouldn't be able to do nothing that I'm doing without him. So my next essential item will be money. A lot of money. Yeah. So that's that. And my next essential item would be my kids. It wasn't able to be here with me today, but I have each one of them on a chain, a picture of them on a chain. So my kids and my family would be my next essential item. Most high, gotta get the money first to take care of my kids. My next essential item, my phone, my phone charger. The majority of my life is on the phone, so I gotta keep a phone. Sometimes I keep two phones, but I lose one so much. So the majority of the time, I just keep one phone and a good charger. So the phone and the charger is essentials that I definitely need. All right, food. And my favorite food is hot wings. Right now, the best hot wings in Atlanta are at the West End Mall, I love them. There's a lady in there who I actually call my mom. She sells the hot wings, she's been working there since I was young. Hot wings, definitely my essential. Lemon pepper with mild sauce, both of them together. Not lemon pepper sprinkles. Lemon pepper sauce with the mild sauce. Everyday routine. My car keys, my house keys, all the keys to my life. Favorite car that I own right now would have to be the Lamborghini car, not the truck. That would be my favorite car right now. But depending on my day, I have a different favorite car every day. So today it was the Lamborghini. Maybe 10 cars, white Air Force One. I would say I'm addicted, but this is probably a little more than addicted. It's like a way of life for me. A pair of white Air Force Ones, I keep a pair of white Air Force Ones any season, even when they're not in the stores. I gotta have a lot of pair of white Air Force Ones. I gotta have them. Size nine, in case you wanna buy me a pair of something. My next essential item is like a package. Underwear, my tank tops, and my T-shirts. I mean, I never wear the same underwear, T-shirts, and tank top. I change my T-shirt, my tank top, and my underwear every day. And most of the time, I be on the road when I'm out of town, so whenever I go, I try to take like Two per day. Definitely one of my essentials. My next essential would have to be my jewelry. Love jewelry. And I got a crazy collection of jewelry in there. Maybe because of my career, me being a rapper. Once I get old and stuff, I think I'm gonna hang it up. It's not as fun to me as it used to be, but I'm definitely, definitely still an essential. You see how like further down the list it is, but definitely essential. I'll show y'all a couple of chains. I gotta have this box, this Icebox travel kit, cause I got too much jewelry to be able to like, just throw it in a bag and throw it somewhere. So I keep, gotta keep the tray. This is not all my jewelry. Somewhat near, but not all of it. Who your favorite jewelers? My favorite would have to be Icebox. I actually go to Icebox like once a week or something. Like, I got the best cleaning in the game. Like, to be having me hand like, definitely. I call this my relaxation pack. Mac Woods and a little relaxation. So I keep me a relaxation pack. I keep a lot going on throughout the day. And a lot of times I just want to get away and get a few seconds to myself. So I keep me a relaxation pack. Definitely one of my essentials. Last but not least, my last essential would have to be my watches. I got a ton of watches, so like I wear a different watch every day. I got like maybe two or three of these icebox um, watch rolls, but I just might bring three at a time or four at a time. I don't travel with all my watches at one time. And this watch actually right here, this is my favorite watch. It's a regular Rolex, just date. This is the first Rolex I ever had. And it was actually a regular, just a regular watch with no diamonds on it when I first got it. And over the time, I probably just built on the watch. Like, I, this is probably one of the most expensive watches I got because I, I did it like piece by piece. I got one side bushed down, another side, another bezel, another, I probably had four, five bezels. I never get rid of this watch. So like, this is my favorite watch. So I had to bring this, like this is one of my essentials. Like, this is the start of baby. And I got on a skeleton AP. I make sure I'm going all Richard Millie though. Like, I'm, I'm gonna let the slow the watches go. But for now, they definitely essential. Thanks for watching my 10 essentials and thank you for tuning in. Till next time.